Hi, I'm Dave Trull with the Trull Gallery, a custom furniture shop in St. Petersburg, Florida. And today I'm going to talk to you about how to read a dial caliper. Dial calipers, as a rule, will read to one hundredth of an inch. This is the average size, it's the six inch. And the jaws, you can see that the dial actually spins. And with this type of caliper, you can actually use it to measure in three separate ways. And I'll show you how to read it as we make some measurements. The most common is an outside measurement like I have here, which is actually 0.576 inches. So it's a little under a half inch. We can also use it for interior measurements. And now I'm going to use these fingers and measure the hole I have here. Again, pulling it up and taking a look at it, it reads 0.984. Just under an inch. There's a third way you can use a caliper as well, and that's using this end, and that's good for doing depths. And the easiest way to show you here is on my table saw. We'll measure the depth of my miter slot, and that's reading 0.82, so just around three eighths of an inch. So there are three separate ways to read it, and again, just as a, as a quick refresher, you're going to look at inches and then tenths of an inch, and then hundredths of an inch. That's dial calipers in a nutshell. I'm Dave Troll with the Troll Gallery, the fine art of furniture making.